It's time for reinforcements. may simply know me as Logan's Prime, and welcome back to yours truly doing a reaction thing to Inuyashiki. It's been a while since I've done this show, I mean, it's, it's definitely been a while. I'm glad to be coming back to it. I've loved the anime Gantz as a kid, uh, trust me, it's one of my favorite animes of all time. I've yet to read the manga, and the manga is quite long, and I would hope someday Gantz gets a re-adaptation, like, anime-wise, and, and given the right love and attention because his oh, Gantz is freaking beautiful but anyway the creator of Gantz he's definitely a person I'm keeping my eye on and I would definitely love to check out some of his other stuff and what did you guess Inuyashiki is one of those other shows that he's done so I'm horrible when I start an anime and I give it its full attention so I definitely been wanting to come back to this show and I know some of you guys have been requesting me to come back to Inuyashiki so, uh, yeah, let's do it. So I do remember the previous episode, um, I remember that Ashiro or Niyoshiki himself, you know, he was stricken with stomach cancer and he was gonna die in, like, what, a few months? His family are a douchebag, his son, daughter, wife, you know, they just don't give him enough attention. And, you know, he was on the grip of death, and, and his family is just whiners. One day at a park, he freaking, I don't know, some aliens show up and... And he wakes up with robot parts, at least that's what I gather. He doesn't have his stomach cancer anymore, so that's also a good thing, but... Again, he's not really human anymore, but then he feels human, so... I don't know. And mind you, giving something is never like that. When someone gives you something, they want something in return, right? It's not like equivalent exchange, I love that, full metal for you. So I wonder what the mystery of this show is gonna be. I can't wait to dig deeper and figure out the mystery. So guys, this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to watch the episode, I'm going to dissect it, I'm going to commentate, I'm going to react to it. And then by the end of the episode, I'll give a quick overall opinion of what I just watched and where I think the show is going to go. So without further ado, this is episode 2, titled Hero Shishigami. <laughs> Let's go. I mean, how would you feel like if you could just rip your face apart and not even feel any pain? Oh, okay, so he has a resolve. He wants to save people's lives. Oh, okay, by saving people's lives... Reminds him that he is human. That's deep. By the way, this theme song is pure badass. I don't know who this kid is in the intro is, but I'm sure we will find out. It looks like they're working together. I'm telling you, pure badass. This intro is badass. What do you know? That's him. Isn't that the dude from the title? Uh, and from the intro, I know that's Inuyashiki's daughter, and she is very much a bitch. Holy shit! It's thundering outside. <laughs> Scary. So who is this guy? His brother? His friend? Yo! There's some God's posters. <laughs> Why are you crying, my guy? One Piece is good this week. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> the show's self-aware? Yeah, what if his friend person is dead? So there's a slasher killer been killing people with no witnesses? Oh, what if it's his friend? I didn't even deduce that. Why would his friend kill people? So because he skipped school, he's like, I'm on to you, buddy? <laughs> oh, so what happened? I see what he's saying. What if something happened to him like Inuyashiki? Oh, maybe this is all part of a game or something. Some sick, twisted alien game thing. Turning into people into robots. And then watch them do shit with each other. Yeah, it's not a shitty manga. How dare you insult freaking gods. Is that Hiro Shishigami anymore? Maybe he got turned too? <gasps> He's willing to show his fr- Ooh! You're gonna give your friend a heart attack! Um... Are you gonna shoot the birds? What? Oh, come on, leave the birds- Oh, okay. What are you doing? Oh my guy! Why you- Poor bird. You saw someone jump in front of the train? Yeah, that happens in Gantz. <laughs> I like how they're doing a the callback. That's pretty cool. Oh! 
Bow chicka bow. Ooh, slap nose, boobs all. Look at that poor kid. I mean. <laughs> Wait, he's not really acting like a good guy. What if he's a bad guy? What if he's that slasher he's talking about? Because he's doing some bad things. What the fuck, my guy? This ain't no symphony here. Yo, look at his back. He got a jackpack or something? Well, he's got a good point. Yo, you should have no excuse why you're not going to school. You wouldn't kill me or some? Why would he kill his friend? It's a good question. He's asking, is your mind still you? I don't know. You know him better than anybody else. Is he still with a shame? He's kind of psychotic at the moment, though. You could rescue people like a superhero. A dare. But did you see all the damage he did? He's talking about that sounds like a pain. You can be like Spider-Man. Well, he's like, yeah, I don't care about being here. I came here to get you back to go to school. Oh, he's like, yo, if you tell me who beat you up, I'll kill them. Yo, he's a little bit too cocky because of his new abilities. Yo, he is dead serious. He's like, I'm gonna kill them. And you coming to school tomorrow? <laughs> Yo, he's like contemplating his self-identity here. He's about to go nuts! What? He doesn't care if they die? He said that as a kid? Oh, he's talk they're talking about manga characters. He only cares if manga characters die? What? Why are you spinning in circle? Wait, you're it? And my dude. Yo, so he is the killer. He just randomly picked a random house. Or not? Wait, what? Yeah, exactly, I'm like... Oh, no! Oh. Are you... Oh, my God! You son of a... It's a lot of blood. <gasps> Are you? <laughs> you sick motherfucker! Oh my god, there's children. They're in the bathtub. Is he gonna kill them? Oh my god. Uh oh. Ooh. Oh. Oh, he's shielding his son. Oh my god, he actually. Ooh. Ooh. He's thinking about his wife. Oh, that's so sad. I'm feeling a little bit now. Wow, because he doesn't care about when people die. He, he doesn't. He's so unsympathetic. So, is this what he's doing it? Oh my Jesus! Ah, oh, poor kid's gonna fucking drown in his own dad's blood! Yo, this is just beyond sick! I'm alive? I feel alive. There's someone else? Oh my god, poor baby girl's gonna- Ooh, please just run! How do you not see all that blood and not be like, Oh my god, I'm getting the fuck out of here. <sighs> That's just gotta be the worst feeling in the world, man. You walk into the kitchen and you see... Bad things. He's gonna kill her too. <laughs> what? My guy! Dude, just fucking kick him or something! I don't know, baby girl, do something! You got some mace? <laughs> what kind of manga do manga. you read? Like, what, what are you, the manga? <laughs> she reads One Piece and Attack on Titan? <laughs> Why are you so excited about One Piece? Her favorite yeah. character is Zoro. Mind you, I've never watched One Piece before. Yeah, your father and little brother are, are very much dead. Oh my god, you're Why such a creep. Oh my god. Just, just poke him in the eye and grab his freaking eyeball. She's pretty much begging for her life. He's gonna kill her. What the fuck? Then we got Mr. One Punch Man here. Oh my god, he, I, I was just kidding about the whole... Him being a superhero kind of thing, even though he said he wanted to do that. He's actually hearing her scream for help. I mean, I'm really surprised that no other neighbor can hear her. He has to drive there? Man, I thought it was closer. Finally attacked the bitch. Oh my god, he's stuck behind a frickin' mouse. 
Oh my god, he heard everything. Oh, that sucks. He, he didn't get to get there in time. That's so sad. Oh, motherfucker, come on. You, I hope you... She ran further inside the house? Oh, no, no, wait. He, he got her on the way out. Motherfucker, get out of the crime scene! They're gonna think you killed her! You know, Yashiki's still here. My guy. Leave this fucking house before people think you killed them! <gasps> He's still there? Oh, yes, showdown, please! Kill Addis, a motherfucker. I wonder what that bang. Oh, yeah, it's not gonna do anything. I guess his robotics is, I don't know, freaking made out of freaking adamantium or something, or rain metal. Ah, uh, <laughs> he gets up like the Terminator! How, how about you bang him back? Yo, this is a solid second episode. My god, why did I stop watching this show? I should have kept watching it through. I've been diving into my Amazon exclusive animes, and I'm glad that I picked it up again. So yo, let's just recap what happened in today's episode. So pretty much, we got introduced to a character named Hiro Shishigami, and this kid is just fucking weird. Apparently he's not sympathetic towards, I guess, death. He only seems to be caring only about fictional characters or characters that, I guess, he has ties to. I mean, he's a huge otaku, so he reads manga, so he likes, you know, One Piece or whatever. Apparently, I guess the same situation that, you know, Yashiki went through, he went through as well. And I guess he has robotics of his own. He's been going out, killing people, trying to find that feeling of feeling, I guess, sympathetic or something? Feeling something towards the dead? It's just borderline sick. I think that's what I gathered. You know, Yashiki was hearing uh, a woman call for help, and he, you know, he was trying to come to the rescue, but he got freaking stuck in traffic. What the fuck the odds? So he didn't get there in time to save uh, the victim. Shishigami was still at the house, and he tried to kill Inu Yashiki, but because Inu Yashiki has the same kind of like robotics, or even better, uh, he of course didn't die because of his stupid little handgun motion, you, you know, spared gun. So now we're about to have a real showdown. Inu Yashiki versus this weird freaking kid, and mind you, I don't even know if this is like the villain of the series, or like what's gonna happen. Of course I want this kid to freaking die, and I hope Inu Yashiki freaking grabs his head and freaking rips it apart, but I don't know. Is Inu Yashiki ready for this? Uh, he's still an old man, so would he still, even though he has robotics, and even though he's old, <laughs> does he have good cardio? I, I know, I'm thinking silly here, but I don't know. I'm hyped for the next episode. I can't wait to see it. What are your thoughts on Inu Yashiki? Are you glad that I'm picking it up again? Have you guys finished it? Have you guys seen it? You guys like it? Ate it? I always ask that. So make sure you tell me, and as well as any positive or negative feedback down in that comment section. Feel free to like this video, subscribe to my channel. I appreciate it if you do. And as always, keep blessed, stay peaceful, and enjoy the rest of your day. Bye-bye.